Hello, Patrick Walchuk here with an update on the Ottawa real estate investment market to the end of June, and we'll be looking at the numbers uh, uh, year to date. And if you enjoy getting these videos, click on the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and we'll send them to you every 30 days. So starting off, as we always do, with buildings that have two to four units in them, in our world, that's called the multi-unit category. There's been 78 of this class of homes or buildings sold this year, and that's a decrease of a little over 14% compared to uh, uh, the first six months of last year. In terms of prices, they're basically flat. These properties are selling for ballpark a million fifty thousand dollars as they were last year And in terms of how long it's taking them to sell they're selling in about the same amount of time You can see on the screen 44 days compared to 40 days and as we move ahead to the buildings that have five or more units in them, the, these are what fall into the commercial category in our world. So you can see that th we've had 18 sales compared to 14 last year, which is an increase of about 29%. Now, this is actually quite high. We're doing well because typically in Ottawa, we'll have, oh, maybe 22, 25 sales in a year. So we're a little bit ahead of the game right now. Um, the average price is showing about 2.5 million compared to over 3 million last year. Now, the prices really aren't down 17%. We had a very, very high end or a couple of very high end properties sell last year, which have skewed the numbers, okay? In terms of how long it's taking to sell, these properties are selling um, in 89 days, which is really quite normal. We just uh, sold a commercial property on Sunnyside Avenue with 12 units, and that took us about 125 days to sell. So uh, things are kind of a little bit normal there, but it is higher than last year. Thank you for watching.